nice wrapping paper. Ooh, lovely smellies. Thank you, Father Christmas. Don't mention it. Electric carving knife. It's from Mum. Apparently, Dad discovered them recently and thought you should have one. It's no reflection on your carving abilities. Hello. Sorry to disturb you, sir. I hope you finished opening your stockings. What's happened? They'll each be dead by midnight Boxing Day. Uh, apparently, this boy, Howard, admitted being responsible. But now he's denying it. Now, his aunt, Mrs. Jennifer Carter, who seems to own this place, she doesn't believe him. She claims the boy was responsible and that Miss Villiers' fall was just an accident. That's where they found it. Uh, yeah, head, that end, uh, feet, well, that end, obviously. About five past two, out cold. She's at Causton General. Do we know if the landing lights were turned on? Uh, they were not, sir. The switch nearest Miss Villiers' room isn't working. Looks like the whole place could do with rewiring. Or knocking down. <laughs> you wanted to see me? Oh, you must be Howard. Uh, Howard, this is Detective Chief Inspector Barnaby. How do you do? How do you do? Um, I'd like to make it clear, Howard, not accusing you of anything, but before we get into any kind of investigation, I want you to realise that wasting police time is an offence, and the courts take that very seriously, very seriously indeed. So if you did have anything to do with this, anything at all, now is the time to tell us. You won't get into any kind of trouble if you tell us the truth. It is nothing whatsoever to do with me. Ah, um, can you tell me why initially you admitted to it? I suppose it was a bit like when the police use undue pressure on a suspect and he confesses just to get the coppers off his back. None of them would believe I hadn't done it, so... I admitted to it, to keep them happy. Do you have any idea how this riddle got into the cracker? A disgruntled employee at the cracker factory, perhaps? Some kind of industrial terrorism? But then again, it might be the result of a much more sinister motive. And when your aunt fell down... Um, great aunt, and... I don't believe it was a fall. Push is more my guess. A push? There's a great deal of anger in this house. And pain. <laughs> don't ask me what about. I know nothing of the details being considered far too young and sensitive for such matters. Thank you. 